Normally, to search for an item or a site, you click on the Microsoft Edge icon, type in the item, and press Enter or click Search. But if you go to certain sites a lot, it's easier to keep those sites on your Favorites bar. So that one simple click brings up the site. If you don't have the Favorites bar up, you can bring it up by clicking on the three dot settings icon, settings, appearance, customize toolbar, show favorites bar, drop down arrow, check always. Or much easier, you can bring the bar up or down by pressing shift control and B. Let's say you want to add Amazon to your favorites bar. Get Amazon up and then over here at the right on the address bar, click on the white star up here with the little plus sign on it. As soon as you do that, it puts the current site up onto your favorites bar. Click done to get rid of the window. Note how the white star has now been filled in with color, indicating that that site is now on your favorites bar. If you click on the star with lines over here, it shows you your favorites bar list. To delete a favorite, right click it and press delete. Another way to add a favorite is to simply drag down the site's icon, like this little lock, from the address bar to the favorites bar. Done. Note that you can reorder the items by simply dragging them to a desired spot. Here I'm dragging my Boston Celtics icon further left. It lands wherever the vertical black line shows. To save space, you might want to have only the site icon showing on the bar instead of the full name. Right-click it and check Show Icon Only. Uncheck the same spot to get the full name back. Or you can right-click it, edit, and type in a preferred name. And click Save. I think for most people, there's a tendency for favorites to accumulate. If your favorites bar uses up more than all the visible space, you can click here to see the rest of your list. You can drag an item up if you want to. However, the better alternative to having too many items on your favorites bar is to move some of your less used favorites to the other favorites folder over here at the right. If Amazon is one of my lesser favorites, I'll drag it over to the other favorites folder. And here it's now under the Other Favorites folder. I'm going to also drag it up into my Stores folder. This way, your most used sites are on your Favorites bar, 
and your less used sites are still available quickly under the Other Favorites folder. To create a new folder, right-click on any of these folders, Add Folder, click on Other Favorites, type in the category, say Sports, Save. Note that if you leave one of these folders highlighted, instead of the other favorites, it will put the new folder inside that folder. So normally you want other favorites highlighted, not one of these, unless you want the new folder to be a subfolder of that folder. Usually you wouldn't want sports to be a subfolder of stores. You can drag an item directly to the Favorites bar or from the Favorites bar to Other Favorites and then to an individual folder. You can drag an item out of these folders. If you want to reorder the folders, say I want to put the Stores folder closer to the top, just under the Favorites Bar folder, you can drag it there. Just make sure that you see this black horizontal line which indicates an open landing spot, or else you might move the item into another folder instead of landing it as a separate folder. Lastly, if one of your favorites seems to have disappeared from your favorites bar, what happened on my Celtics icon? What you have most likely done is accidentally sent it to a folder other than the Favorites Bar folder. You need to make sure that you have the Favorites Bar folder highlighted when you click on the star icon. I hope this has been helpful. If you want help in deciding whether God exists or not, check out my website by clicking on the link at the lower right. How's that for a change in topics? <laughs>